Hello everyone, it's Raven, and I am back with another ship review. Uh, we are doing a 12-hour live stream at the time of recording, so I might be re uh, responding to a few people in chat here and there. I will try to give you guys context if and when I do. Anyway, the next ship is I. I saw the mass and I saw the si like the size of the file, and it's huge. Um, so yeah, this is the. USS Albatross by Willavid Seven. So uh, let's let's see what this is all about. Oh God. Uh, close that. Oh. oh, geez. Okay. Um. Art. Oh. Did I just get shot? No, we're good. Oh, I bet you those are docked reactors. Okay. Oh, so this is a little bit older, because docked reactors, but those engines, though, I like it a lot, and it's kind of got this line detailing that is really interesting. Let's get up nice and close. Oh, wait, holy crap. Oh, no, I thought the, those are rear-facing turrets, I assume. Yeah, that's what it looks like. I thought they were ships for a second. This has some ridiculous line work. I like it. I mean, there's enough negative space that the line work works. And, alright, so the lava engines are a little dated, I guess, but they work for the most part. I don't like the sort of, you know, hard edges that they do, but that's me personally. But still... It's wow. Okay, let's uh, let's start looking at the side here. Do a nice slow pan over. Look at this thing. Holy crap! Okay, this is cool. The plate work, the line work is really nice. Like really nice. Holy wow. I mean, now, I do line work like this. Or have done line work like this. So I'm privy to it, but... This is... Whoa. Whoa. I don't even... Uh, wow. Um, okay. I'm not even going to go to the front yet. Like, no, we're, we're, we're going to just go to this wing panel. Like... Like, you can see... Okay, so this is... Is that... It's just... That's just... Like, exposed wiring and stuff. Like, that's so good! That's so good! And then we got some turrets up here. I'm digging them. I just don't even know what to say to this. It's awesome! Um... Freaking great job you got turrets here and there that bar you can barely tell because they're just they're integrated with the hull so well that looks like a door uh jesus this is really cool um let's swing around to the front here i mean this thing looks like a monster it looks like it would eat your face off and i think that's sort of the point oh wow I'm totally digging this, like, this hexagon. That's really cool. That's really cool. This is so well done. Already. This is the form of it. I mean, it's a very chunky build, for lack of a better term. But just the overall form is solid. Um... Okay, I don't know how I feel about these wedges right here, personally, but I don't hate them. I just think that maybe maybe slabs or something, or maybe just not doing it, I don't know. That's a really tough one, but like, damn. Damn. Let's check out the top. Like, it, this is... This is really well done. The red just used as this, this line work is really, really good. That is uh, 
it's proportioned exactly the right amount. Personally, I don't like the hazard stripes that much. I think it kind of takes away a little bit. But it's not bad either. I just think uh, I don't know. This is, those are probably missile doors. Those are probably missile doors. Please let those be missile doors. We'll find out soon enough. So it looks like this is your bridge. Okay. And then that looks like an elevator. So we'll go back to that in a few. I still want to check out the underside. So we got turrets all along the top here. They're really well proportioned to the ship. I mean, this is this is really, really nice. Let's swing back behind the engines here again. Looks like there's a little airlock there in, in the back. I'm not going to lie, it looks a little bit like an anus, but I'm willing to forgive that. I've got a feeling I'm also going to get completely and utterly lost in this ship. And I'm also totally cool with that. See, alright, so here's the thing. Most people neglect the bottom of their ship. You obviously did not. And I love you for it. Like this, even the bottom of the ship is, is well detailed. And greebled. And follows the whole pattern and everything. Phenomenal job on the outside. I mean, for taking this chunky ship... You know, I mean, and it is a chunky ship. I mean, you've you've added enough intrigue and enough little details and stuff that uh, it just, it works. And it works really well. I, uh, I don't even want to know how long it took. But very, very, very well done. Um, yeah, I... <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm kind of speechless. I really am. This is... This has happened twice on the exterior ships now. And just... Damn. Okay. Let's, uh... I saw a little thing over here. I know I have no idea how long this took you, but I don't think I actually want to know the answer to that question. Let's do this. Okay, so you've got... You've even done raised armor plating here. Or what looks like it. Like, that's that's super nice. That's super nice. Okay. Okay. Turbo lift. Call turbo lift up. Call turbo lift down. Okay. Use when light is on. Oh, okay, there we go. Oh, very nice. I guess we'll start here. We'll just use this turbo lift here. Uh, so that's the turbo lift, and then... Oh, God. All right, we're going to get lost here in a few. But first things first, the bridge. This is a bridge. This is really, really well done. Like... This feels like a bridge, and also mini stripper poles. I am 100% in favor. I don't know if you actually meant them to be stripper poles, but they are now. You got probably like navigation or something like that, and then maybe I'm I'm just gonna I'm just gonna call these I call that side navigation, this side comms because that's more fun. It's just just wow, and the interior is nice. You've got different textures for the floor and the ceiling. Hint, hint. That's really, really well done. It looks like all this stuff was made in advance, too. Like, this is... This is uh, something else. So, Alright, we're in gravity. <sighs> okay. Let's take a walk. Maintenance access shaft. Uh, okay, so I'm not even going to go in there. Uh, i got a feeling briefing room. All of this is actually uh, uh, area trigger controlled. Very nice little table, briefing room sort of thing. I dig it. It's small but really effective. Um, yeah, I got nothing there. Uh, 
kitchen. Sneak in here and grab a bite to eat. Okay, very nicely done on the stoves. I really kind of wish that these thruster plumes would work when the, the ship was moving because it would be hilarious. And oh my god, I can look out into the into the mess hall, I assume, or the galley. That's so nice. Yeah, I mean, and then you got your fridges, I assume, and then the grating. Like, that's just super well done. Oh, and we can cross over to the other side. Okay. Uh, so this is the mess hall is right there okay we'll go in there in a second crew quarters that way transporter that way med bay security office restrooms aft airlock and then the bridge is forward okay so let's go in here this is so you've got like the the tables really well done tables all along here and these are uh for your 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 plebs <laughs> basically your your uh, soldiers and then I assume this is for the officer's mess. Did I just go up level? Oh my god. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah. That's really nice. And I actually like how you're using the med cabinets on the sides. That, that just breaks up the line enough. Enough. Okay, so this is officer's quarters. You got a little desk and... Okay. Click that. Okay, so that's just the lighting. I'm down with that. And then you've got yourself a little bed, some medical cabinets, storage, and then where are you? Okay, that's just probably a computer in the next room. I'm assuming. Yeah, this thing is supposed to crew like a hundred some people. Crew quarters. Okay, so this is for regular crew, I assume. We got this the foot lockers. And then, yeah, yeah, okay. Another officer's quarters. Okay, so we've, we've basically now seen the officer's quarters. Cool. And the crew quarters. Easy day. Uh, wow, there's so many of them. Hold on. You're using slab doors. Okay, I dig that. Really well done on the whole opening logic, too. Uh, that must have taken forever. Okay, right here, men's restroom. Holy crap, it actually looks like they even have a plant. You got yourself a bathroom. I like it. And then Sonic shower. All right, I'm digging that. This thing looks straight. Yeah, like someone said in chat, looks straight out of Star Wars, but more detail in a way. Med bay. Okay, I'm going to be real hard on the med bay. If I can find something wrong, I will. Yeah, I take med bays personally. Okay, so this is probably like surgery. Chemical quarantine. Okay, okay. I can dig that. And that it looks like it. Um, blood bag, maybe? I don't know. It's a weird place to have a blood bag, though. We've got all of your... Vitals. This is really nice. This is actually really, really nice. I can't find too much in a way of fault. The ceiling is really well done. Um, crap. I want to tear the ship apart, but I don't know if I can. I don't know if I can at all. I'm going to try, but... Women's restroom. I'm assuming this is probably just a mirror. Yeah, okay. So this, all right, so then this goes over here and we go down here, transporter, really nice transporter room, digging it, really digging it, chair just chilling here, I'm not 100% sure why, but I'm, I mean, that's cool. We'll pass through, security office, <laughs> little, little, little brig cells. I like it. And then we can come up here. Okay, so essentially the same desk and chair off to the side. I'm not sure what the chairs are there for. Maybe if you took this chair away and did like a locker, like an arms locker sort of thing right here, that could be really cool. But like that's the only thing I can think to add because, you know, security office or whatever. Um, that's really nice though. 
Uh, okay, so down here. Hey, we're back at it at another turbo lift, so we wanna. Use this one. The red light is on. Okay. Uh, that one, maybe? There we go. Okay. So we're in. We want to go down. Really nice, simple elevator right there. Oh, what is this? Is this the airlock? Airlock staging deck, okay. Wait, do I need it? Okay. So then that would get me out. Okay, cool, 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 cool. I got it. Close that, pop that one. All right, that makes sense. So you've got a lockout system. That's fair. Um, you can change these blocks right here over to girders now. And I think that might work a little bit better in here. Uh, we've got control consoles on either side. I gotta say, man, this is just super nice. So, down. Okay, can't go down anymore. Let's go back up. So it looks like you got one main deck. deck. That's fair. Uh, security office, yeah. Let's close that door again. I really love how snappy you made the, uh, the, the opening and closing. That's really, really nice. Um, okay. Restrooms, and then we've got all the officers quarters and all that good stuff let's head forward and then this is the crew quarters we'll close that door too be nice close the doors you know all that good stuff head over here bridge is that way I'm just wondering if I missed anything actually you know what I'll do crew quarters after bridge okay so, I'm not 100% sure where the core room is. Kitchen. That's the kitchen. Yeah, alright. Briefing room is on this side. Okay. So, this is the... If I go in here... Go oh! There's a whole other section. Okay. I'm digging this. So this looks like engineering. Escape pod. Holy crap, you have a whole shitload of of escape pods. And they're, they're proper little escape pods. I love it. I'm going to have to get in one of those in a minute. Um, step one, open hatch. Okay. Okay, launch yourself that way. Reload and close hatch. Okay, so I will do that in a second. This is logic maintenance. Oh my god! It's logic maintenance, but it actually... It's, it's a proper room! Most people just pack this stuff... Like, this is really nice. This... this I think I hate you. I, th I think I hate you. I think that's what we've come to. Also, um, I need to escape the ship now. Everything's gone to hell. Hit that. Hit that. Pure imagination. Wow. It just launches all of them. That's really... Oh, so that's what those were. Okay, sorry I kind of broke that, but I don't care. That's so cool. Okay. Uh, where's the core? There's the core. All right. Let's let's jump in here. Holy crap! This thing is solid, like completely solid. Okay. So this is the core room, which I didn't see earlier, and it is also gorgeous. I I can't find fault with this really. I hate you for that. I really dig this ship. I really do. This is really cool, and it's been a pleasure to check this out. Um, 
I think you can change some stuff out for girders here and there, little pieces, and it might might make it feel a little bit better, especially like in an engineering section. Um, let's see. I think you might have docked reactors or yeah so you can change these docked reactors out now for the um holy crap you have a lot of these okay yeah you can change all that out for the uh auxiliary power block but other than that like i don't even know i missed an entire floor how did I miss an entire floor? This thing has a hanger! Okay! We are gonna go back exploring. We are not even remotely close to done. Is this right? No, we gotta go up. Did it break something? Okay. Okay. If there was a way to do a marker sort of thing to know where this th alright so I think I jammed it or something hold on nope it's coming down now don't please don't squish me okay so it's just not that fast cause it's gotta go a long ways alright we have to go down I can't believe I missed an entire freaking area. Okay, is this it? Oh my god. Pilot's quarters. So, kind of the same deal. Okay. So these are pilot's quarters, men's and women's restrooms. Hangar bay. This is for secondary support. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. I mean, they're cute. I'm de I'm, I, I like this. I really like this one. This one's a really nice design. I, I could just pick that out. Um, one thing I will say is, and I, I said this on a previous review of another ship, um, be careful with all white like this. Maybe add a few other colors, especially on such a small ship where you can't do cutouts. You know, uh, that might help a little bit. But this is a cute little little thingamajig. We're going to have to figure out how to launch these. I like it. Uh, maybe add either a few other colors or something just to break up how white the front end of this is. It gets a little bit blinding, like over here. But all in all, it's still a solid design. I like it. So you got one on either side, and it looks like you got an extra bay oh my god we're not even through even like half the hangar so you got little shuttles <sighs> how long did this build take you jesus open hangar boy doors okay um so i know you already did a lot of work and I like these doors, but I would love to see them as rail doors somehow, if that's possible. That would be really, really cool. Uh, but yeah, alright, so I'm guessing... Call turbo lift up, maybe? Oh, oh, we got flashing lights. We've got flashing lights. That is sexy. So I'm going to align to that. And then I'm gonna go. Maybe add wireless to this so that you can follow it, but still. 
just I hate you so much for this ship this thing this ship is gorgeous what is, what are you are you in like an APC type are you an APC Manta Ray Shuttle, okay. Inherit thrust from docks. Okay, so this has a bunch of docked entities. Just di uh, 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 um. Okay, I need to come back to this. I have an idea as to what it does. And I need to know if I'm right. Holy crap, okay. So that's turbo lift control. So this is one of the hangars. Uh, we'll go this way first. Uh, this is like a gunship type thing. You can drop in. Okay. You... I don't know. No, okay. Is that... Okay, I think that's just normal. Okay. I thought you did like freaking display module stuff on there. Jesus. These are really nice designs. I'm assuming these are like gunships or bombers or something along those lines. What the hell are you? These are definitely bombers. I see that the the missiles. Um, one thing, uh, really quickly, you can use some slabs along here if you want to kind of. Well, unless those are docked entities and they kind of don't share the same lighting, so they might be docked entities. If those aren't docked entities, then you can use slabs. <sighs> Jesus. I can't even keep up with this. There's just so much going on. This will tell me if it's a docked entity. Okay, it's not. Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. You can use some slabs here, here and there, um, just to, especially on this side, to kind of hide away a little bit of that. Might help. I don't know. Okay. I'm trying to figure out, you know, what am I supposed to do with this? Like, really? The hell am I supposed to do with this? It's too good. All right, let's go check this out. These little buggers, that looks like a docked entity to me. Uh, so these are, I assume these are like little mini fighter sort of things, maybe drones. Is that a door? That looks like a control block for a door. Oh my god. I'm in heaven right now. Oh. Uh, that was the coolest door. That was the coolest door. I need to do that again. I need to do that again. Clicky. For the love of god, people go download this ship right now and just upvote the living crap or whatever. <laughs> Download it, check it out for yourself, give them ratings. This guy needs to be considered a master builder like a year ago at this point. This is... We gotta do this again. Oh. This is the coolest door I've ever seen. I am stealing this. This ship... So, I don't do this often at all. Normally, I uh, upload a ship onto my single player, check it out, and then... I'll delete it out of my blueprints. I'm not doing that with this. This is staying on... You even got anti-personnel turrets up at the top. I didn't even see that. I... This ship is staying on as... Um, as one of my... You know, in, in, a, in a special sector for inspiration. It's too good. Hangar control. I don't care about hangar control. I'm done with hangar control. Too pissed off. At <laughs> okay, so this is more probably like uh, engineering 
stuff, more hanger control stuff. Okay. Okay, I need to I need to I need to fly one of these out. Hold on. Is there Is there like launch rail logic for this? I wonder. Okay. At least at least there's that. There's no it doesn't look like there's any launch rail logic, but that's there's pickup points, but no actual. Okay. Docked. Just so I can jump in here. Go over here, nav, turn off docked. <sighs> Holy crap, man. I don't know how, or why, or whatever, but I am so glad you built this ship. This is this is one of the coolest things I have seen in a in an incredibly long time. I mean, really. Okay, gonna squeeze back in here. I want to see a fleet of these things, really. Okay, I, uh, we're gonna go check out the shuttle because I feel like this thing does something cool. I don't know if it does or not, but it definitely looks like it because I know that there's docked entities on this. I can seize them. Oh, no, okay, so I gotta be a little bit faster. Okay. So let's zoom out a little bit. Easy day. Alright, wings out. Holy crap, that was elegant as shit. Hold on. Wings in. Damn, dude. I... <sighs> the amount of hatred I have for you is, is just beyond words. I'm not going to bother inheriting thrust, so... So what I can do with this is basically go, okay. Coming in for landing. I'm doing this from all the way out here. It's probably not the best idea, but... Just sort of do that and then snap too. <clears throat> Dude, yeah, no. This is... This is, like, beyond Master Builder quality. I need to send this to Delmont, like, now, honestly. This is just amazing. And I'm guessing it's all pretty much replicated over on this side for the most part. Yeah. Okay. What is this? So this is door control. Okay. Fair enough. Fair enough. Okay, so I am going to give critique points after we watch this door again. Little things that I think might just push this a little bit high, a little bit further. But if there's not much. I won't pretend like, you know, there's a whole bunch of stuff you got to do. Like there's not much at all. Is there anything I missed cuz we're going to check anything else out in build mode? Yes, of course, there's stuff I missed. Flight suit storage down here. Cargo bay. 
didn't even see the giant freaking cargo bay in in there. I didn't realize that this was all cargo. That's legit as shit. <sighs> My hatred for you, for you. And understand that me hating someone is typically considered a compliment. Um, really and truly knows no bounds. Uh, holy crap. You're basically, I try to do this style of greebling and stuff, and you've done it way better than I have. You've done it better than I... I'm somewhat convinced you've done it better than I ever could. Which, uh... Makes me... A bit irate. How do I... Just actually blow the doors off. That doesn't make a lot of sense. Let's see. Open hatch. Okay, so it actually has to have the things that probably attached before it'll actually close. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. Okay. I, okay. Here are the things I'm going to pick out. Number one, phenomenal gre greebling and everything. One thing I would love to see, even if it's tiny, right? Like, maybe like somewhere down here just a little like you could almost do it like just like a little a couple little like pokey sensor tower sort of things asymmetrical I'd like to just see really minor asymmetry in this um, not a whole lot it doesn't need a whole lot it's got enough going for it but just, so, just something little um, or like you know out of he out of like here just it sticking out or something like that. That would uh, that would bring this into the next to the next level. Obviously, little things you know change out the docked reactors uh, would be a good idea. But all in all, all in all, I really can't come up with anything. It's really bothering me that I can't. But I can't. I mean, it's... It's a phenomenal build. I am so incredibly happy that I got to see this thing. Uh, the Okay, yeah, the other thing. Maybe tweak these engines into ice engines, because you get the... The, um, the clean line straight down. But I mean... Damn. I've been shown up. Basically, that's... that's. This is, I don't think I'm ever going to beat this. I don't think it's possible for me to beat this. Like, that's... You know. It's just how it is. I guess. Really, 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 really well done. Um, I am keeping a copy of this for... Uh, for inspiration and and everything else, I don't I don't know what else to say about this ship. I I just don't. I mean, everything on it just it all fits. I think that's the thing. It is even the interior. You've got you know like this red line here. It splits the sides. You've got greebles. It all fits. It all feels right. It feels cohesive. And that's something that, you know, a lot of the ships today that I've been reviewing um, at the time of recording um, just haven't. Oh, yeah, slabs on this. That will help you. I really do think so. Um, but, like, beyond that, just everything feels like it's in its proper place, like it's meant to be there. I 
I don't really know what else to say. Just really well done. I, uh... <sighs> hate you. And, and in my chat, they're saying I'm going to be fapping to this later. Who says I'm not doing that now? It really, really phenomenally done. Um, I really like it. I really like it. I really, really want those dock reactors cleaned out, though, so that there's not beams of light shooting out of this thing's ass, because I think it just takes away a little too much. But obviously that's just, you know, that's a gameplay issue. Still. Um... Send me more ships. If if all your ships are this sort of caliber, I mean, not necessarily this size, but this caliber, send me more. I I I, I want more. Give me more. Um. Yeah, somebody did point out there doesn't seem to be a whole lot of AMS turrets on this thing. I'll go ahead and turn on turrets, and we'll corroborate that. Yeah, you might. You might be able to get away with a few more AMS, but I don't know where you'd put them. It looks like you're going for more form. Um, if you can sneak them in, cool. Yeah, I could see these you could turn into AMS turrets, actually. Yeah, sneaky AMS turrets right right here. Um, but really and truly, I don't, I don't actually think I care. Uh, this thing's stats, 77 million shields, I mean, yeah, uh, holy crap, it's only, it's only 355 long, 99 high, and 187 wide, I, it looks so much bigger than that, that is really well done, okay, it's time to play with the weapons. And oh my god, there are weapons everywhere. I like it. Main doors, lock doors, power on. So we're going to turn that off. Well, Alright. So first we have... That looked like... Yeah, so that's a, a damage beam. Oh wow, we've got old sort of just chunky style, okay, cannons, missiles, okay, those look pretty evil, alright, uh, this looks like a swarmer array maybe, or nukes, that's a nuke, okay, what are your controls, open pot hatch, launch, close, can I just close them, okay, no, it has to have the pots, okay, cargo, Cargo load. What is cargo load? Oh, I bet you that's if it's docked. Okay. Outer lights and hangar lights. Hold on. Hangar lights. Turn that on. Is that these side ones? Something? I don't I don't know where the hangar lights are. I feel like that should be these. Or is it the next setup? I don't see any difference with the lights. Maybe I'm just being an idiot. That's totally possible. Wow. And then, uh, okay, and then we got main doors. So I open both of them at the same time. Yup. Okay, I want to see this from the outside. So that closes up like that. Flips up elegant as fuck. So much incredible hatred. There we go. That just slides right open. That's really nice. I'm uh, 
Stealing that idea. Okay, and then main doors, door lock, power on and off. Alright, so I think maybe a little bit of the logic is a little bit messed up here and there, but like, I don't know. It might just be me. There's a good chance that it's just me. Wait. <laughs> Gotta be kidding me. You can just stick this up in this freaking ceiling if you want. Oh yeah, okay. So that's... Wait, that's... That's your way up here. Okay. So then this comes up. Snaps into place. I don't even know what to say anymore. I mean, this is superbly done. Please keep building things like this. Please, for the love of God. Um, again, you might be able to get away with girders right here. I don't know if that's what you, the aesthetic that you want to go for. Um, I know I'm. I love girders, and they're definitely useful. Um, so consider using some here and there. Uh, I think it, it it brings a nice texture that that really kind of gives you the feel of support beams and the like. Um, they could be useful here and there. Yeah. Wait, what are you? Okay, so your door control. Okay. I just flipped it accidentally. There we go. Yeah, I got nothing else to say about this thing. It's expertly done. Uh, you guys need to go download this, check it out yourself. It's uh, it really is phenomenal. It really is absolutely amazing. And this is uh, this is probably one of the my favorite builds that I've ever seen. Period. I. I absolutely love it I think uh, I think I'm gonna call this here uh, thank you guys so much for watching if you want to check the ship out it's down in the description um, please do and uh, Willavid 7 thank you for submitting the ship it's been an absolute pleasure checking it out even if uh, I also want to claw my eyes out because I don't think I'm ever gonna quite pull this off so there's that thank you guys so much for watching and um yeah i'll see you again next time